Hey, it's Sarah from Everyday Spiritual, and today I want to talk to you about the movie What the Bleep Do We Know? It is sort of a fictionish, non-fiction doc, docu, docudrama about quantum reality, I guess. Um, quantum physics, quantum reality, and what it is, it's about, um, mostly about alternate realities, parallel universes. Um, it's directed by William Arntz, Mark Vicente, Vicente, and, and Betsy Chase. So this movie is fun. I find the acting to be a little forced at times, but it's all right. Just suffer through that because the message is great. The message is that there may be alternate universes and quantum physics is getting closer and closer to proving that quantum universes uh, do exist, that parallel universes do exist, and so this movie illustrates that in a unique way, in a way that everybody can understand. And so it shows this woman going through her life, and she, it's fiction, so she's just like living a normal life, I think she goes to a movie with this guy, and he's sort of more non-fiction, and she's sort of totally fiction, which is interesting. So. So she's our unreliable character, and he knows more than she does, I guess. Um, so she's going through her life, and she makes certain decisions. And in the movie, when she makes a decision, you can see many different pathways start. And so this is the idea that in our life, when we make a decision, where we were before might still exist where we're going now might exist, and there may be other ideas that your mind had that you narrowed down to make this other choice, which is quantum field theory. So out there in the world, ahead of us in time, space, reality, there are all these choices, right? So do I want an apple? Do I want a banana? Do I want to make some food? So there's all these choices, all these points in the field. And when we get closer to what we're going to choose, we will start collapsing other choices, all right? So maybe I, I decide I don't want pizza. I don't want, you know, to make anything. I'm going to go for something fast. All those other choices leave the field. Now we're left with things we can eat right away. And then maybe I decide that I only want fruit. I'm going to have a piece of fruit. All the other decisions leave the field and we're left with fruit all these points that are fruit okay and then we decide um i don't want anything citrus that sounds too sweet all those things leave and this is all happening in your mind and so we're narrowing down narrowing down narrowing down we don't even realize it's really happening and we decide we're going to have a banana everything else leaves the field and we put the banana in our mouth but here is the Here's the thing, maybe all of those other choices actually do exist. Maybe we did eat the apple and there's a parallel universe out there where we ate the apple. All right, so this really comes into play when we're making decisions about our life that have more impact, like relationships or purchasing a house or like the big things, right? So. Maybe we met somebody earlier in our life and we felt a little spark of chemistry. So maybe there's an alternate universe where you followed that spark of chemistry and you're with that person. And you dated and you got married and you had kids and the whole bit. And then maybe there's reality that collapsed all the other choices and you chose to not date them. And now you're with somebody else completely. And that's what you're experiencing now. But somewhere else in quantum reality, you're with this other person. Weird, right? So this is kind of what, what the bleep is about, and it's really fun, and it's a very interesting thing to explore. I highly recommend it, even though the acting is... All right. Don't forget to sign up for the newsletter. Every Monday we have a journal exercise. Every Wednesday we have a meditation, guided meditation. Every Friday I post an article that bridges the gap between scientific research and spiritual practices. And you get some free stuff when you sign up. There are free guided meditations and things to do with your mind. And there's this other interesting kind of weird book on spirituality. So sign up now and here's the link.